St. Stephen's Basilica is not only imposing from outside, but also its interior is overwhelming. The church can hold 8,500 people. 50 different kinds of marble and fine stone surfaces were used for the decoration of its walls primarily local varieties. It is decorated with stunning artworks composed of sculptures, mosaics, paintings, stone works, glass works made by the most well-known Hungarian artists and craftsmen. The imposing interior of the church is covered by a dome. It is 67 meters high, 22 meters wide, and supported by four pillars. Its mosaics were laid to the designs of Carol Lotz, whose work can also be seen in the Opera House and the Hungarian Parliament Building. In the center of the dome is the Creator with Jesus and the seven Old Testament prophets nearby. The statues of the four cardinal virtues are located below the angels and prophets in the drum. Justice, temperance, fortitude, and prudence are depicted in female form. Symbolically the dome is held by the four evangelists, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, which are portrayed in mosaics above the pillars. The pillars are decorated with statues of the most well-known Hungarian saints. King Saint Ladislaus, the Night King who conquered Croatia, which marked the beginning of an expansion period for the medieval Kingdom of Hungary. Saint Elizabeth, the daughter of Andrew II, who dedicated her life to help the poor, and Saint Gellert, an Italian priest, the teacher of Saint Stephen's son, who was killed by the pagans during the Great Pagan Rebellion in 1046. The main altar of the basilica is located in the front of the semicircular shrine at the end of the nave. The central element of the main altar is a statue of Saint Stephen carved in white Carrara marble. Above him an angel holds the holy crown, symbol of the Christian Hungarian vision of the state. Surprisingly you won't find the Virgin Mary or Jesus here, in fact special permission was required from the Pope himself to do that. The bronze relief around the wall depicts important historic events relating to Saint Stephen. The ceiling of the shrine is decorated with mosaics made in Venice according to the designs of Beulah Benzor. The side altars are decorated with fine stoneworks and paintings. The colorful glass mosaic windows are masterpieces of the renowned Hungarian artist Miksharot, who designed also the windows of the Hungarian Parliament Building. A remarkable artwork of the Basilica is the altar of Our Lady located in the south nave. The altar painting made by Giula Benzor depicts a Saint Stephen offers the crown to Mary, a symbolic scene where Stephen left without a successor after the death of his son, offers his country and crown to the Virgin Mary. According to the legend, Mary appeared to Stephen in a dream, promising to protect the young Hungarian Christian state. Since then, Mary has been worshipped as Our Lady of Hungary, the country's patron, and is often portrayed with the Holy Crown. The statues of the altar depict two Hungarian saints. On the left Saint Dima, the son of Saint Stephen who was killed by a wild boar during hunting. On the right, Saint Margaret, the daughter of King Bela IV, who sentenced her life to God, in exchange for the country had been saved from the Mongols. The most valuable relic of the Basilica and the Hungarian Christianity, the holy right hand of King Saint Stephen, is also displayed here. The holy right, as it is called, can be viewed in an ornate reliquary built in Vienna in 1862. The mummified hand is kept in a secure glass cylinder inside the reliquary, where it is laid on a pillow, and decorated with gilded silver leaves and gemstone bracelets. The reliquary house, reminiscent of a Gothic chapel, is made of gilded silver, and decorated with statues of Hungarian saints including the statue of Saint Stephen on its top. The basilica often hosts important weddings and funerals of well-known celebrities and state leaders. The renowned soccer star Ferenc Puskás, the immortal captain of the famous Hungarian golden team is buried here. Due to its outstanding acoustics concerts are held regularly. The most remarkable religious festivity is the annual procession, held on the 20th of August, the day of Saint Stephen, when the holy right hand is carried around accompanied by thousands of believers.